What's up, everybody? The roar here. And here I am on a tram on Ocean City, Maryland. We're stopping to let people on. But also the beach. So we are here in Ocean City, Maryland. We're actually on the boardwalk. We are traveling from 27th Street where the boardwalk ends. And we're gonna head down to the inlet. Do you want me to come? There you go. Yep. What's up, man? What's up, guys? Once again, we are on the Ocean City tram. I'm gonna take it about 10, 15 blocks, maybe. If it doesn't go any faster than this, I'm just gonna get out and walk. But uh, we're gonna head on down to the, uh, the inlet. There we go. Welcome. I think I'm actually getting in trouble by putting the, uh, the phone out there. So what's up guys? How are you? Welcome to Ocean City, Maryland. This is the live stream here on the boardwalk. The beach is right over there. And then right here on the right are the hotels. I mean, this place, this place is awesome. I love it. Take a look at the pair. Once we pass by, we're almost up here by the pair sailors. It's pretty awesome. Look at this. This is so awesome. Right here, take a look at this hotel. All these hotels right here are absolutely new. New within the last, I'm gonna say new within the last five or 10 years. Can you guys hear me okay? Awesome. What's up? I, I, I'll be droned. Is that what it is? That is awesome. 
I checked out your channel too. It's pretty awesome. How are you today? Look at that pool. Awesome. I'm good. I'm good. That's really cool, but the air goes through from it. There's a lot of people on the boardwalk. Take a look at this if you can see it. We are on the, we're closer to the end of the boardwalk. I think I'm gonna take it another five or 10 blocks and then I'm gonna get off and walk. I am in uh, Ocean City, Maryland. That's where I'm at. No, Ocean City, Maryland. Uh, I don't know how far it is, maybe three hours south of the Jersey Shore. I don't think so. Do you wanna get in here? Okay. It is, man. This place is awesome. I've been coming here since I was a kid. Look at these bars. See all these right here? Hold on, let me turn it around. Was it facing me the whole time? Oh man. Oh, but it wasn't. <laughs> all of this right here, brand new hotels that I just put up. See right here? That was one of the original hotels here in Ocean City. It was put up in the 1930s. I believe this is Harrison House, if I'm not mistaken. All right, I'm gonna get out here. All right, take a look at this. So this hotel right here was built in the 1930s, one of the original hotels here in Ocean City. It's really cool and it burned down like two or three times that was uh that rebuild was like in the fifth uh 40s maybe 1940s take a look this is what i was writing oh that it's pretty awesome So I'll be droned. Have you been to Ocean City before? There you go, look at this. It is a nice boardwalk, man. It really is. What does that say? Oh, nice. That's where I'm from. I'm from VA. Born and raised. So look at this. This whole boardwalk right here. Cool thing about the boardwalk is these hotels used to have a. It's called a portable boardwalk. They brought it out in the summertime and attached them all. And then I believe in the 50s, they finally did away with that and started building the boardwalk. 
to where it's uh, stationary. It's pretty cool. There's the beach plaza right here. The beach plaza is another hotel that's been there since the 30s or 40s. Actually, no, I'm, I'm mistaken. It's from the 20s. These hotels have been here since the 20s. It is. It really is nice here. I'll cut across here show you in a minute. This right here is the 13th Street Beach. Cool thing, man. Every, every street here in Ocean City has a phenomenal history. It's really awesome. We've got shops up and down here. I'm also keeping an eye out for a uh, an outlet for my phone so I can charge it. Hey, we got someone else joining us. What's up? But uh, keeping a phone out right here on these. I don't know if you see these light posts. Andrew Thomas, what's up? How you doing, man? Thanks for joining us. Glad you can make it. But on these some of these uh, posts, I'm trying to find another one. It says Instagram, YouTube, Hotspot. I'm assuming it's to charge your phone, but I am not sure. Thanks for joining us, Andrew. Where, where are you from, Andrew? I'm in uh, Ocean City, Maryland. I'm actually walking the boardwalk. We walked, I took the tram from 27th Street where it ends. And uh, I think I got off of 15th Street, so it was about 11, 12 streets that I uh, that I took on the tram. Because this is where the action starts, right here. Past that is just hotels and things like that. You're from Tennessee, I think I saw. That's pretty awesome, man. I would love to make it to Tennessee. I've been there to Nashville once or twice. Actually, what am I talking about? Once. I've been there once, but I was way too young. I was too young to drink. I think I was like 19, but it was it was really fun. Plan on making it back. It's the same train that we were on. This right here is one of my favorite places to eat. Look at that, the Blues Brothers. You mean in, uh, in Nashville? Oh yeah. I mean, is my glasses crooked? Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's that's pretty cool. Yeah, man, I love Nashville. I would love to. Uh, I gotta stop showing at the uh, hotels. People are on the balconies. I don't want to show them. Yeah, man. It's actually pretty cool because the boardwalk, the Ocean City boardwalk is like top three busiest boardwalks on the East Coast. And I think it came in number one for most things to do. So I think at one year, it was Myrtle Beach, uh, Ocean City, and then Atlantic City. But now I think those have changed. I think now it's like 
Myrtle Beach, Atlantic City, Virginia Beach, then Ocean City. So it'll be kind of cool to see those other boardwalks and see how, how they've changed. Because I've been on those, on their boardwalks, each of them, and they just don't see, they just don't seem uh, very busy. Look, a hidden Mickey. Oh, I can't change it around. Look. The furthest Mickey Mouse from, Ocean City, or from Disney. <laughs> Thank you, man. Awesome. Appreciate it. Yeah. Virginia Beach is all concrete. Here, look. It's almost the original wood. It almost looks like the original wood there. By the way, guys, I just want to share something with you. See this brewery right here? That is one of the best breweries that I've had. It's been a while. I have not. It's been a long time, though, since I've been there. But uh, it is one of the best ones here on the East Coast. Just want to give them a plug. It is real boardwalk. That's awesome. That's another thing. The two oldest boardwalks on the East Coast is Atlantic City and us. The only reason why Ocean City is number two for boardwalks is because we replaced ours. And I don't think Atlantic City, maybe they did, I don't know. But one of them ousted the other because they have not replaced theirs just yet. So I thought that was pretty cool. By the way, guys, so I'm at 80% on my phone, maybe less. If you see in the footage as we're walking that there's a plug, hit me up, let me know. Man, I'd like to go there, yes. But I don't even put that You should, man. Absolutely. And if you guys do YouTube too, man, maybe we could just all meet up up here in Ocean City and do like a triple vlog or something like that. Or double vlogs. <laughs> what did Adam Lewis say? Dueling vlogs. Alright, check this out. Look at this. So all the way right there and all the way down is all the original buildings that were here. I'm gonna see if I see something. See this concrete barrier? On the other side here, used to be, uh -oh. when you go back into the hotels, there was space underground. They stored the boardwalks. They rolled the boardwalks underneath them during the, uh, the earlier, well, yesteryears, I guess I should say. That's pretty cool. Oops, ah, I can't change it around. By the way, guys, thanks for joining me, man. I was, uh, wasn't sure if people would uh, get the message that I was having a live stream today. Appreciate you joining. And I'm gonna leave it up too. At the end, I'll leave it up. So I, I do wanna do live streams like once every two weeks. And I'm hoping also as people search online or YouTube, my live streams will come up, maybe get some more uh, more subscribers. I, I don't know if that's how it works. What do you guys think? Have you guys done live streams before? pretty cool look at this the chew house oh, 
Yep. <laughs> All right, I'll be drone. Thanks for joining us, man. That's awesome. Thank you. I wanted to see this real quick because it says, look, Ocean City's buildings of historical significance. That's pretty awesome. So again, another original house in Ocean City. Where is that? <laughs> I don't know either. I'm going to have to look that up. I have several History of the City books. Again, man, I'll be drone. Thanks for joining us. I appreciate it. I look forward to your future videos as well. Oops, excuse me, guys. Sorry. Hi. Sorry. Thank you. I love this city, it's pretty awesome. Take a look at this, these porches. Look at this. Where, guys, yes. Hold on, I still can't. Yeah, so up here is the kite loft. And it's an entire store of kites. So we're going way up there. Okay. So it's like right there. There's the kite store. So check this out. One year at this kite store here, they had a whale. And it was, uh, oh man, I think it was like 100 foot long, 100 feet long. It was massive. It was flying. They had it up here on display, kind of like where that is right there, but much higher. And Ocean City and the FAA made them take it down. Yeah, yeah. What is that? You want to be in the vlog? Say, hi, I'm live streaming right now. Yeah, yeah. What's your name? Malik. Nice to meet you. You got anything you want to plug? Your Instagram, what's your Instagram? Awesome, awesome. All right, look me up, man. I'm the Roar. The Roar. R O T H E R O R. All right. That's awesome. Go check out his Instagram. <laughs> but yeah, this is pretty cool. Some more, more restaurants. Uh, he was talking too fast. I should have asked him to repeat himself. Malik. Malik HD. I, I don't know. I think I should probably learn how to uh, be able to have someone plug. <laughs> Hopefully he'll find this video, put his information. So if you do see this video, I'm going to have it up and leave it up. Put your information down and... Uh, you know, we'll send some uh, followers for your way. Look at this. The first Hooters on the boardwalk. <laughs> okay, cool. There was a lot of controversy when that opened. It's actually pretty funny. <laughs> there we go.
Awesome dancing. That's pretty awesome. Brian on the go is in the house. What's up, buddy? How you doing, man? Thanks for joining. It's pretty awesome. <laughs> Oops, sorry, go ahead. <laughs> Andrew, that's pretty funny. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, man. I went there a couple times. No worries, man. Thanks for stopping by. Appreciate it. It's pretty awesome. That's pretty awesome, yeah. But yeah, I remember uh, I remember going to the Hooters once too, and I don't know, the food just isn't that great to me. It's kind of crazy. They have them all over at Redskins uh, Stadium, Fixed Field. Look at that. Sounds like a train. Do they have good pretzels? I didn't know that. What did uh, I missed one? Hold on. Yeah, man. Yeah, I missed his live streams. I'm glad that I caught it last night. Dude, too bad no one got a Wuvalanche. That would be cool. <laughs> Look at this. It's my favorite view right here. Just at the beach. I know. It was funny. I just saw a vlog with him where he, some guy was, uh, you know what, I think it was vlog 1009. It was a confrontation. And man, he kept his cool. It was pretty cool. Firearms 101 is in the house. What's up, man? Thanks for joining us. For those of you just joining us, we are here in Ocean City, Maryland. See now, right here, Right here starts the shops and the busyness of the boardwalk. As you can tell. What's up, guys? Fire on, firearms 101. What's up, man? Thanks for stopping by. Oh, didn't get you. Hold on. Do it again. Oh. <laughs> I got to get better at working the camera. I'll be honest with you. Look at that. Bull on the beach. Pretty awesome. Okay, guys, serious question. Who's tried them? Dippin' Dots. It's called the ice cream of the future. <laughs> Thanks, Brian. Something I've always wanted to do. Oh, look at this. This is an old school tram right here. Look at that. So the cool thing about those trams is that was an old school one. They used to have really, really old ones. I don't even know what they were. They're like dune buggies. But then they switched them out for the Jeeps, the early 2000s, 90s, 90s, 2000s. And then they got rid of them for the tram I was showing you earlier. Oh, dude, I'm gonna show you this. This guy, this guy designed the entire building of this uh, art gallery. And you can come in here and buy. Look, go to oceangallery.com. 
How you doing, man? Is it okay to come in with a, I'm live streaming, is that all right? All right, perfect. I've been coming here for years. I wanted to show everybody this place. It's pretty, oh, it is very famous. So check this out, guys. By the way, come here, go on the website. You can buy these paintings, they're all for sale. Oops. Thanks, bud. I appreciate it. All right. I want to show you one more thing about this place right here. Look at this. I haven't been there. Oh, man, that's awesome. I will definitely check that out, Brian. Beverly Hills. That's pretty awesome. Okay. I'm going to show you this. Let's go over here a little bit. Hold on, let me go around here. Look at this thing. This is all done by him. And one more thing, you guys ready for this? Look at that. Look at this, it's the Batmobile. Now he actually made a Batmobile for the actual Batman movie. This is not it. Look at this. So this guy made two Batmobiles for the movie, and when the movie was over, they dumped them in the Atlantic to form a reef, for an artificial reef. It's really cool. But take a look at this. <laughs> look at that. It's got a keyboard on the back. I mean, how awesome is that? But yeah, you can look that up. He, uh... But yeah, this is the third Batman video right here that he has made and designed. Uh, there was another one, the original one back in the 70s. Thanks, Brian, man. That's awesome. I am so excited. I can't wait to get the 4,000 views. That would be even better. That would be awesome. But uh, the original movie, I think it was for the Batman TV show. His car was used in it that he designed. And after they built it, they took it out, I think, 10 miles in the ocean, out that way, and they dumped it and it formed a, or, uh, you know, same thing that they do for trains, the old metro trains, so it can form artificial reefs, I guess. I think that's what it is. I'll show you another thing. Look at this. Oh, man, our views are climbing. What's up, guys? Look at that guy right there. This guy has been doing this for years. So the cool thing about that, because of the sand sculptures that he does, they used to have sand sculpture competitions that were broadcast on ESPN that were right out here on this beach. They do it every now and then. They don't do it annually, but I've noticed they do it every one, one, five years, I guess. Yeah, man, they do them all over. But what I find out, the guy that does them here in Ocean City, he was the original guy to start it. What's up? Oh, oh hold on. Go ahead. <laughs> What's up, guys? <laughs> hey, check me out. I'm doing a live stream. I'm uh, the Roar, T H E space R O R. Hey, that is so cool. We have more people. It's pretty awesome. I love it out here, guys. Thanks for joining me again.
<laughs> Spider Man. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Thanks, man. Hey. Yeah, man, I love it here. I've been watching Adam's Hollywood streams. It's like, you know what? I'm gonna do one in Havosha City. It's pretty cool. I don't want to do these more often in different cities, too. Would you guys be down for that? By the way, that place right there the best burritos and tacos you've ever had. If you're ever down here, tell them the Roar sent you. It's pretty awesome. Actually, any of these places on the boardwalk, tell them the Roar sent you. Thanks, Brian. Thanks for joining us, Brian. I appreciate it. I want to show you this, too. Man, I am super lucky to have people subscribe to me like you. That is awesome, guys. Thank you so much. Here's, I want to show you this right here. Ocean City actually built a monument to the victims of 9-11 right here. Dedicated to the firefighters of the world. But take a look at this. I actually bought bricks. We brought bricks, me and my family, and had them there. I keep forgetting where we have them. But take a look at this. Take a look at that. This, this is the original. This is a steel beam from the World Towers the Trade Center, from the towers. You see, look at this. One's part of the Trade Center. This twisted piece of metal rests here as an enduring memorial to the 343 New York City firefighters. Look at that. It's pretty awesome, guys. Yeah, man, I enjoyed that. And we actually, my we have uh, my aunts and uncles all. We all bought bricks. Went went to help build that memorial. It's pretty cool. Look at this. Man. I want that. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna try to walk quickly here. There's some copyrighted music. Let me see. I like your lady out there, brother. All right. Hope I don't get flagged for a copyright. I'm trying to walk out of here really quickly. A lot of cool things to show you guys. There's a purple moose. If you ever come here, you want to see some good bands? Come here. Hey. The Purple Moose Saloon.
So we're coming up on the end right now of the boardwalk. There's still some cool things I want to show you down here. It's pretty awesome. So if you guys see anything in this live stream you want me to go back to, you know, let me know. Oh. Actually, I think this is it. It doesn't say it, but that is an Instagram hotspot that says, I mean, whenever you see those boxes. So I'm assuming those are plugs that I can charge my phone if I need be, if I need to. Oh man, look at this. This is what I wanted to show you too. I'm trying to get in, but I don't know if they allow live streamings. But it's a really, really old hotel, all of these hotels. Especially that hotel. I went to look it up when you get a chance. The Atlantic Hotel. That is a one of the original hotels here in Ocean City, here on the boardwalk. And if you ever go in there and get a room, the doors, there are no hotel doors. They're like saloon doors every room so i remember seeing that i was like what on earth is this <laughs> but it, you know but they kept the originality of the old time hotel there which is pretty cool it's that hotel right there it's called the atlantic it's been here since the 20s the 1920s actually right here oh that tells about the uh pier ballroom because there was also a ballroom on that pier right there is pretty cool oh man it's incredibly old 1920s is when it was built and it was a great fire too the 30s and everything got torn down or burned out look at that Ripley's believe it or not Now, what's really funny about this place is right now it's Ripley's Believe It or Not. But when I was a kid, an under 21, that was an under 21 nightclub where I went to and it was a nightclub for 15 to 21 year olds or 15 to 20 year olds. And we were dancing in there with that shark is protruding right now. That was pretty cool. Yeah, man. Oh, yep. Oh, you've been to Ocean City at uh, Fire Arms 101? That's pretty cool, man. This place is awesome. It really is. You come up here a lot? You know what? Say what? No kidding. Man, if you're up, up, ever up here again, let me know. Come up. Bam, Mike is in the house. What's up, buddy? Thanks for joining. Uh, Ocean City, Maryland is where I'm at. I'm actually going right now onto the pier. The pier is uh, has a bunch of rides, a bunch of games. And the cool thing about the pier is it's... It's run by a family by the name of Trimper. And uh, Trimper Rides have been, been in business for 120 or 130 years. They've owned amusements here in Ocean City. And I'll show you an amusement park that's even older than this. Yeah, I do dishes and make beds and help you out on chores, right? 
Hope I guys didn't leave you or uh, didn't. Uh, did that interrupt the stream? Thanks, man, Mike. Appreciate it. I'm excited, man. I got to sound of the bell. We're in the hole. I'm gonna try to get out of here because the copyrighted music again. So apparently, I have two videos that were copyrighted by the artists, but they didn't pull them, they're just monetized. So I try to try to be extremely careful on that. Oh, I remember five subs, man. <laughs> that was way back. <laughs> that was way back. <laughs> Thanks, man. Yeah. So two months. Oh, that's what I wanted to say tonight, too. This is my two-month anniversary vlogging. 110 subscribers. Completely. For oh. I was so excited about doing the live stream. That completely skipped my mind. Man, I am so excited. I want to thank, thank everybody out there that made this possible. That's, that's awesome. Two months. Two months. 110 subscribers. So I also wanted to announce that at 250, I'm going to do a giveaway. So if we get to 250 subscribers, I'll put out a video or a live stream. And whoever comments on that live stream will enter to win like gift cards or stuff like that. So that's pretty cool. So share, share with your friends. <laughs> Let's get to 250. Look at this. Oh, go ahead, you're good. I was just thinking about I can't believe I forgot about that. I was thinking about that this morning, the whole time, two months, consistently vlogging, unfortunately not live streaming, or uh, not live streaming, uh, daily. It was just interfering with work and everything, but I'm glad. It's definitely, this change in my life is, is a very positive one. I'm very, very proud of it. But I'm happy that I'm sticking to it too. <laughs> If you know me, it's, you know, it's very tough for me to do, but I'm glad I'm doing it. That is awesome, man. Congratulations. Congratulations, firearms. Look at this. Look at this. This game has been here since I was a kid. I was seven years old. Walking up there. <laughs> Man, that is awesome, Firearms 101. Way to go. That is a feat. I can only imagine. Can't wait. Yeah, man, that's pretty awesome. Look at this. Here's what I wanted to show you this place. That was a tie. Hey, that was a, that was a tie. You guys get to do it again. This theme park that I'm in, this indoor theme park, is hun almost a hundred years old. It's insane. Look at this. Look at these rides. This all used to be outdoors. Every single one of these. Look at this. 
that carousel is like 110 years old. It's pretty awesome. I mean, just look how old the architecture is. Like this right here. Oops, sorry. I mean, just look how old these are. I remember when I was a kid, I was riding all these. I was like eight years old. I remember writing this. Look at that. I rode that trolley when I was like 10. It's pretty awesome. Okay. Really cool. These rides though are a little bit newer. Did you say 700? Hold on, let me go back there. That's incredible. One year, 700 subs. Bam and Mike, that's awesome. Way to go. Yeah, man, me too. I really do enjoy that. Seven hundred subs! Wow, that's incredible. Way to go! This is the first haunted house I went in. Look at that! It's really cool. So what we're gonna do is we'll go to the end of the boardwalk. Where the inlet is and then we'll walk back i'm going to show you something really cool that we passed but we'll go back hope you guys are enjoying this we're at 53 minutes holy cow oh man bama mike man I've been watching his videos for a while. I remember seeing him on uh, Adam DeLuce streams. I think that's where I still heard of him. And, and he has some awesome, awesome vids. They're pretty awesome. So whoever here is not subbed to Bama Mike, go sub to Bama Mike. That's pretty awesome. And thanks for joining me tonight, Bam Mike. That's awesome. Bam Mike, where are you from? <laughs> that same sign is on the other side too. All right, here. I want to show you guys this. All right, check this out. Right here. Where my follow my finger. See where that boat's at? So that is called the inlet, and that was cut by a hurricane in 1933. Take a look, you see the rock formations over there? Way over there. That's where the original train station at Ocean City was. And right here, there, I wanna come out here one day and dive because apparently there's, there's uh, the inlet right here, the water is, three or 400 feet down, there are houses, cars in the 20s, it's all got washed away. This was like a parking lot, a sand parking lot when the hurricane of 33 came in. 
and just devoured everything in this area, including the train station, which stood like right there. So supposedly I heard there are rumors that there's uh, an old train station down there that washed away, even an old train, a locomotive. But it's like three or 400 feet down. People have done diving experiences down there. Which, I mean, it's just so far down. It's pretty cool. And actually, if you go in here, this is the Life Saving Museum. You, they actually talk a little bit about that. It's pretty awesome, man. So this is the inlet, the final, or the end of the boardwalk at Ocean City. Thanks, man. Thanks, Fire Arms One. Appreciate it. I think this is going to be not only my log longest vlog, but my longest live stream as well. There's, there's going to be more to come, man. I'm hoping to do this once every two weeks. That would be like, ridiculous. That would be crazy. Look at this. Hold on, let me read that. There it is. Where is that at? No Kalua? It was Kalua? Is that what? Is that how you pronounce it? Ah. Uh, of it. <laughs> Actually, I thought you were trying to do North California or something like that. I was like, I've never heard of that. What? No worries, man. I remember doing, uh, when I did the Super Chats for Adam the Woo, and it came out saying something wrong. I'm like, ah, crap. <laughs> Is that what I was trying to say? Look at this thing. It's, look, I love this. Oh. Ah, I gotta learn this a little bit more. Look at that. Big bird. Just calling my name over there. There's an abandoned theme park near there called... Near me? Where I'm at right now? Hey, did you see Big Bird? Big Bird. <laughs> it's popping up on the trash can. Try to hit a ball. Just try to hit a ball at his face. No, Alabama. Oh, okay. Man, if there was an abandoned place here, and I've been looking, there were several. I mean, back in the early 2000s, there was a lot of cool abandoned places here. There was an abandoned theme park right on the mainland. But it's since been demolished for nice, nice houses. But yeah, this whole area. Yeah. I want to show you this real quick. Have you guys heard of Thrasher's french fries. This right there. I'm gonna come here for Thrasher's french fries. If you've ever been down here, this is the number one french fries on the boardwalk. And I think it was voted best fries in America like three, four years in a row. And it's really awesome. Look at this. Take a look at it. 
Thrashers, French fries. Yeah, they are. Actually, take a look at this. There's also a famous Baltimore Orioles um, baseball player. This, this is his barbecue shop, restaurant. Bo Boog Pals. You guys remember Boog Pal? I remember him vaguely. I don't think I've ever seen a game with him, but I do remember him. It's pretty cool. Let's see what that says. All right, I'm trying to read this at the same time. <laughs> yeah, it is. Man, I'll tell you what. You guys want to wait in line for, with me? And then we'll end the stream. I'll show you the greatness that is about to happen. <laughs> this is pretty cool. What's that? Yeah, yeah. Here, hold on. Oh, there you go. What's it? Yo. What's up? <laughs> What's up? <laughs> there it is. It does, man. Yeah, absolutely, man. Is that? It's not that far. I mean, from Tennessee, maybe seven, eight hours, maybe. Not even. I don't know. But it is a awesome place. I try to come up here several times out of the summer. Maybe it ends up being once every three weeks. It's one of my favorite places to be. I love the beach right here on that side. You know what? My uh, little switch thing, Centuru, is not working well. Really? You haven't? Wow. You gotta come up here, man. If you do, hit me up. We'll do a, we'll do a video up here or something. So what goes good with Thrasher fries is lemonade. That will be my next stop. It's gonna be awesome. So someone, I think, some Firearms 101, you've had Thrasher fries before? Oh, I lost the stream. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> I wanted to end on this because it is awesome. Matter of fact, tell you what, go to Thrashers on Facebook or Instagram. Tell them the roar sent me, sent you. Let them know the roar is here. It's pretty awesome. You should see the operation that they do too. It's pretty, pretty awesome. This is what Ocean City is famous for, right here. It's pretty awesome. Oh man! <laughs> the roar for president. I don't think that will fly very well. <laughs> All right. Oops. All right, so while we're here waiting, what are your guys' favorite boardwalk snack? Favorite beaches you like going to? Or where do you guys want to plug? It's pretty awesome. Look at this. That place right there. Been around for years as well. Not as long as the one down at the end was like 80, 100 years or so. It's pretty awesome. Look at this. It's incredible. Be right back. Sounds good. So I think I'm going to end the vlog here in a little bit. We're over an hour, guys. An hour and six minutes. You guys stuck with me. Thank you. That's pretty awesome. 
So I was gonna do like Q and A's, but I think I'll do the live stream and Q and A's. Medium, small. Thank you. Small. Yeah. Yes. Perfect. Man. Look how big we get this. All right. Give me a sec. 42 states, I'm 44 now. Oh. That's awesome. Really awesome. All right, guys. I'm going to somehow put this down for a sec to pay. All right. The small one. Yeah. All right, here you go. Just do the six. There you go. I'm gonna take it. Thank you. Appreciate it. I'm gonna show you one more thing. Thank you. You too. All right, guys. Look at this. Look at this. Thrashers. Wow. So. Oh man, I forgot to do vinegar on it. So the cool thing about these fries is you do not put ketchup on it. No trans fat, no ketchup. It's actually an insult to put ketchup on these. But I am going to do vinegar. Look at this. Look at the vinegars. Just <laughs> I bet you can, man. These are awesome. Look at that. I mean, it just gets in there. <laughs> All right, let's find a cool place to sit down here. All right, guys, what do you think of this live stream? You guys want to see more of it? I think it'd be pretty cool to do a lot more of these. Absolutely. All right. All right, I'm going to try to find somewhere to put this down for a sec, just to end it. I don't see any place, though. <laughs> All right, I'm going to use this. I'm going to set these down for a sec. Oops. All right, I'm actually kneeling down here right now. All right. Wow, 68 minutes, guys, an hour and eight minutes. That is awesome, man. What does that say? I know. These chats don't stay very long, do they? Another place that was good was the fries, smash burger, right? The smash fries, yeah, man. <laughs> With the egg one. What's going on with Smashburger anyways? Like, they all went out of business in D.C. I haven't seen them around. I had, one, I had them once. They were good. What's up, Bama Mike? Welcome back. 69 minutes. Wow. Anyone have any questions you want to ask me? I hate being there. I'm actually at a, a uh, Alaska stand, which is a another hot dog stand here that has been it burned down and everything else. So... Oh, here we go. Let me try to go over here. No, that's not going to work. That won't work at all. In Charlotte, Orlando. They have one there? It's pretty cool. All right, look where I'm at. I'm going to show this around real quick. This is the Alaska stand. It's one of the oldest hot dog stands, not only in America, but here. Uh, here say hi. There you go. <laughs> that is awesome. All right, guys. That looks classic. It is. It is, man. Let me tell you, this, this was built. It was built in 19... 1920s, I'm going to say, I believe. I'm not actually uh, totally sure on the exact date, but I think it was definitely the 20s or 30s. Like, yeah, that's pretty cool. America. <laughs> it's 
it's pretty awesome. All right, guys, I'm gonna end the stream. Thank you so much for joining me today. Uh, I hope I hope to do more live streams in the future. Um, maybe next time I'm up here at Ocean City, I'll do another live stream. You know, but again, thank you for two months of vlogging. Appreciate it, Andrew. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. That is awesome. All right, guys. The stream is over. Now I just got to figure out how to end it. <laughs> and thank you, all of you, once again. I just can't thank you enough. It's so awesome. Thank you. I'll see you tomorrow.